How are we doing guys? This is my first trip of the year. I'm getting started. The truck barely started because it's been sitting there since a little bit before Christmas. <laughs> put some of this good stuff because I don't want my fuel to freeze my fuel lines or any of that so um, yep So uh, that right there is my parking space and there's a brand new trailer there. No, it's not mine. I mean the trailer's not mine, I just don't know who and why they dropped it in my space. I'm gonna charge them. <laughs> nah, I'm, uh, I'm leaving already so when I come back, uh, probably tomorrow or the day after, actually tomorrow, and if it's still there, then we're gonna have problems. So I ain't paying for somebody to they can come and park here for free. I ain't paying for somebody else. I understand, like they may have needed the spot or whatever. And that's why I'm gonna leave them there today. I think they got here yesterday. And if they're still here, then either I'm gonna call a tow truck or I'm gonna park the Volvo in front of it. And they ain't gonna take it till they pay me Two, three hundred bucks. I'm heating up my lunch in the middle of the highway. <laughs> Apparently, there's an accident. Well, I already picked up the load, and uh, and I'm on my way to Detroit. It looks like there's an accident up front. So I don't know how long we're gonna be sitting here. That sucks. Yeah, well, I got this load. I picked it up in Romeoville, Illinois, delivering in Brownstown, Michigan, which is a suburb of Detroit by the airport. I got a pretty good rate on it. Got it for uh, sixteen hundred bucks. Pretty good. So I don't have a backhaul yet. I'm gonna look for one tomorrow. Let him head back. The rest of the week is gonna be. Uh, it's not gonna be a very good week. It's gonna be like really cold, so I'm more than like just gonna park and chill, <laughs> or head south. I don't know yet. So uh, yesterday I was looking at a at a load. It was going uh, from uh, Alsip to Kansas City, Kansas, and it was posted for thirteen hundred bucks. I was like, damn! So I put a bid. Of uh, 2100 2100 bucks and uh, someone booked it at 1300 that's 500 miles 1300 bucks like why because it has the option where you can book now for 1300 or email the dispatcher or the broker and he would get back to you on Monday because this was Sunday so I was looking at that load I saw it Sunday and then Sunday at night it wasn't there anymore so it either got booked or it got cancelled which I, I, I'm thinking it probably got booked because who, who cancels a load on Sunday well maybe the shipper did I don't know but if it got booked for 1300 bucks, like, I don't know, man. Why? I'm going half the distance. That's 300 bucks more. But then again, people get desperate and they'll haul for peanuts. I don't know why the fuck they do that, but... It is what it is. 
Looks like there's an accident up front. I don't know how long we're gonna be here stuck and there is a pretty long line. Well, it's in the highway. It must be a long line. Damn, I don't know how long I'm gonna be waiting here. There's a, a rest area about uh, 37, 38 miles from here. That's where I plan on, I'm parking for the night, going to sleep and then uh, wake up in the morning, keep going. And I got another 40 miles and I'll be in Detroit delivering my load. So I guess I'll keep waiting here and I'll see you guys at the rest area or tomorrow at the delivery. Oh, letters. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Oh, and have a happy New Year's. You. Yep.